Um, we did get our third blood result back. We were hoping to, for it to be about 448 and it was 684, I think. Good morning. Welcome back to my channel. I apologize for my voice right now. I'm getting over a cold. Um, but today is a big day. We're going to get our very first ultrasound. I'm five and a half weeks pregnant. Um, and if you have not seen the previous videos, just to catch you up a little bit, I've been getting blood work done to make sure the levels, the HCG levels are rising. And the first time it was at a 52. The second time was 112. Third time was 684. And um, the last time we got a draw, it was at, um, I can't remember. It's like 18 something, I think. Um, so they are definitely doubling. So there's probably nothing to be worried about, but I personally need to see it on an ultrasound to make sure everything is fine. What we're doing today is exciting and nerve wracking all at the same time. Um, but I thought I'd bring you all along. If you're new here, um, and kind of don't know my history. I had an ectopic back in January and that was my second one. My first one was back in 2015. So it's just super important that I get an ultrasound as early as possible. Um, I'm really glad though that my levels are raising appropriately. Um, more than actually. They just want it to double every 48 hours and it's been doing more than that. So I really don't expect it to be ectopic, but <clears throat> just to give me peace of mind, I really insist on an early ultrasound just to make sure everything's fine. We'll be there in a few minutes. How do you feel? Aggravated with people that can't maintain a speed. That's how I feel right I'm now. I'm talking about the baby. Well, I'm excited. I'm getting more nervous as like the closer we get. Ah, it's gonna be all right. Don't worry about it. Everything will be all right. All right, yes, magic, 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 magically magic. making me lustrous. This, don't worry about it. Yeah. Uh, now you're just, supposed to go. Oh. Uh, I feel so much better now. I really hate that I can't talk right now, but it's not as bad as it was like a couple days ago. It was really bad. So. Oh my gosh, you're gonna run these old people off the road. <laughs> Everything looks good. We get another ultrasound in two weeks, which I was surprised about. And we get one at 32 weeks and possibly 36 weeks. Because we had a breech baby. Yeah. So. You're going to relax your knees all the way out to the sides. You'll feel that really cool gel and there's going to be like a big push. Scoot your bottom down one more scoot. Oh, I know. I couldn't. I can't imagine. I'm. I'm with you. Oh, okay. All right then. All right. So this black circle here that is a gestational sac and it's intrauterine. So that is good. It's where it's supposed to be. Yeah. Inside. Good deal. We're gonna look at the ovaries last though, so we will take a look at that too. I'm just gonna measure this first. And you haven't had any bleeding or anything? No, mm -hmm. Okay. So inside of that gestational sac, that big white circle there, that looks like a yolk sac. So that's the first sign of an early pregnancy. That's good. Here, measure that. Crazy. Think she can tell if it's a boy or a girl yet, right? <laughs> so right on top of that, it looks like there's like this tiny, tiny little white blob that looks like it's probably a fetal hole. Mm -hmm. It's so, so small that it's like not even registering on my computer, but that's consistent with your dating because you're only five weeks and four days. Mm -hmm. So that's what we would expect to see. Yeah, we right just want to make sure it was in we just needed to make sure it was in the, right, the right, spot. right spot. Yes. Because this is our we've had two ectopics before, yes. so so hopefully next time we will see baby, you know, uh -huh. something a little bigger. 
Oh, it's it's in the right spot, so yes. we're happy. Yes. I'm gonna scan through your whole uterus. And there's only one, you say, right? So right now, I only see that one little blob, uh, but it, like I said, it's so. Oh, were they in the same? Well, they could be. Oh, in the same they thing. They could be in the same sack. Yeah. I oh, it's not two sacks. Sack. Oh, okay. You could have two sacks, but you could also just have one. There's that makes three different some... types of twins. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. So right now, I'm just seeing that like tiny, tiny little yeah. blip. Yeah. But that doesn't mean that there won't be two next. There's probably not gonna be two. It's Those are running not. out. I think there's just gonna be one. It's as well. totally <laughs> Alright guys, well here's your little gestational sack and your yolk sack. So awesome. That's great. It's in the right spot. It's in the right spot, right there in the middle. This is the uterus, right in the middle of the uterus. So that's great. Good. Uh doctor will look at all the measurements that I took, so she'll kind of go over that with you in a lot more detail than I just did. Okay. Okay, we are home. I'm warming up some dinner for the kids. We're just having some leftovers from yesterday. Um, and the kids are playing outside. So I'm actually, it's really nice outside. So I'm thinking I'm going to just bring their food out there and they can eat it. Um, hopefully it's warm. Definitely not warmed up yet. <laughs> um, so yeah, the ultrasound went great. Baby is measuring right at five and a half weeks, which is where I am. And we'll have a, another ultrasound in a couple of weeks for viability, I guess. Um, that's what she said, a viability ultrasound. Um, I don't think that I will ever shake the nerves now um, for ultrasounds, especially the first one for me because they have not always gone great. Um, but from now on, it should be smooth sailing, praying that it goes well for the rest of the pregnancy. Um, so far, I don't really have any symptoms. I in that two week wait period, I had some lower back cramps, but that's really it. Nothing crazy and still so far, I don't really feel like I have any real symptoms yet. I think that's gonna be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new and you wanna subscribe and follow along with this pregnancy, I'm happy to have you. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up and I will see you guys in the next one, bye. I'm seven and a half weeks pregnant. So excited.